friends, and welcome to today's special podcast, where we dive into some of life's most profound and important aspects. Today, we are exploring the topic, what is true devotion? In this episode, we will learn what the true meaning of devotion is and how we can incorporate it into our lives. We are honored to have with us Sadhguru Amrit Sahebji, joining us from India, who will share his deep insights on this subject. Welcome, Sahebji. Thank you, and I am truly grateful to be here and have the opportunity to discuss this important topic. Devotion is something that connects deeply with every part of our lives. Sahebji, devotion is often seen as limited to rituals and worship. But you say it goes much deeper. Can you explain what the true meaning of devotion really is? Absolutely. The true meaning of devotion is not confined to religious rituals and external acts. True devotion is an internal experience, a connection that comes from the heart and soul. When we speak of true devotion, we are talking about dedicating ourselves in every aspect of our lives, whether it's towards a higher purpose, a guru, our parents, or our loved ones. This devotion, when carried out, transforms every action into a meaningful and spiritual one. That's truly calming to hear. Saheb Ji, could you also explain how devotion and surrender are interconnected and what is the hallmark of a true devotee? Devotion and surrender are indeed two sides of the same coin. When we surrender with a true heart, that is when devotion manifests. Surrender means letting go of our ego, desires, and confusion and offering ourselves wholeheartedly to a guru, parents, or loved ones. The hallmark of a true devotee is that they embody this surrender in every action, not for outward show, but from deep within their heart. It seems like devotion to the guru is a central part of true devotion. Could you elaborate more on this? Yes, devotion to the guru is one of the most essential aspects of true devotion. The guru is the guiding light in our lives, showing us the right path and helping us progress spiritually. When we dedicate ourselves to our guru, our ego diminishes, and we move towards spiritual growth. Without a guru, life remains in darkness. Therefore, true devotees are those who follow the guru's teachings and walk on the path illuminated by their wisdom. It's true that the guru's guidance can dispel the darkness in our lives, but, Sahebji, in today's fast-paced world, how can we practice true devotion and surrender? In today's busy world, adopting true devotion and surrender might seem challenging, but it is not impossible. Devotion does not mean abandoning your responsibilities. It means approaching everything you do with a sense of dedication and love. Whether it's caring for your family, fulfilling your work responsibilities, or contributing to society, when you perform these duties with devotion, you will find peace and fulfillment in every action. Your words are truly inspiring, Sahebji. You also mentioned the teachings of Guru Kabir in relation to true devotion. Could you share more about how Guru Kabir viewed the true form of devotion? Indeed, Guru Kabir provided simple and precise examples to explain the true form of devotion. He said that devotion is not about external rituals or public displays of worship. True devotion is something that arises from the soul, something that purifies the heart and gives direction to our life. When we practice devotion with sincerity, every aspect of our life transforms. Kabir Ji said that the true form of devotion connects us to our soul and brings inner peace. Those are beautiful insights. Finally, Saheb Ji, would you like to leave our listeners with some final thoughts on how they can incorporate true devotion and surrender into their lives? Yes, would like to say that the path of true devotion and surrender may not be easy but it is the path that leads to spiritual peace and joy. When you perform every action with devotion and surrender, you will find success at every step. Devotion is not just about rituals, it's about performing every task with love and surrender. So, live each moment with this spirit, and place true devotion in your heart. Thank you Saheb Ji, your words have truly helped us understand the real meaning of true devotion. We hope our listeners are inspired to embrace true devotion and surrender in their lives. And with that, our special podcast for today comes to a close. 
If you enjoyed this episode, please share it with your friends and family. We'll see you next time in our next episode. Until then, goodbye and take care.